If you're pulled over by the police in Alabama, there's three reasons you should stay cool. The first is that if you act nervous, that's going to prolong the detention. In other words, the police are going to get more interested in you the more nervous that you're acting because they're going to say, well, something's up. So you want to try to stay as cool and calm and collected as you can. You probably want to keep your hands on the steering wheel or if you're the passenger on the dash. You don't want to do any sudden movements because, well, if you do a real sudden movement, they're going to yank you through the window. And even if there's no criminal activity by you before that, if there's a scuffle, they're going to charge you with assault on a police officer. That's a felony. So try to stay calm, stay cool. Now, here's another reason, reason number two, that you should stay calm. People have a imagined view of what will happen when they encounter the police, particularly if they know there's something up, they've got some sort of criminal activity going on. The reality is that most times things are less serious than people think. For example, somebody who has a, uh, let's say, some marijuana or a uh, controlled substance, if they don't have much of a record, the reality is that many times your lawyer may be able to resolve that without you having a conviction um, and without you doing any kind of time. So the future that you imagine and what you're afraid of may never come to pass. So try your best to stay calm. And the third reason is that if you act like a fool and you're a jerk with the cops, you're a wise guy or whatever, that makes it harder for your lawyer to accomplish things that are helpful for you. Because whether we like it or not, the prosecutors will often talk with the arresting officers. And if the arresting officer says, so-and-so was a real jerk, it means there's less tool in our toolbox as lawyers to try to get you a better result. So I hope that you're not stopped by the police, but if you are, try to remember to stay as calm as you can, be polite, stay cool, calm, and collected, and don't act a fool because it makes it harder on your lawyer and ultimately harder on you. If you do find yourself in a legal jam and you want our help, just give us a call. The phone number's below. I hope you enjoy these videos. Thanks for watching. I'm Andy Siegel.